So I'm about to head over to the C Library over at Amherst. Um, I think my next um, hydroponic tote, if this current one is going to work, will be the tomatoes. Um, that's what I'm looking for is basically my favorites. I've got cherry tomatoes, but they're not the sweet kind, which is what I like. Um, and then I'm going to look for roma tomatoes as well, and then maybe a leafy green. <clears throat> and to fill up the um, tote that I have now. But the timer arrived, and I'm going to probably start it either today or tomorrow. I have to check the pH level and add lime juice to it to lower it. And then I think I'm going to start it this week. Um, I'm pretty excited. I feel good about the setup because it's just basically an in a bigger aero garden, which I have obviously had success before with the kit. Um, and I just basically uh, made a bigger one. <clears throat> I drilled holes into the top of a tote and I filled it up with water and there's about 18 plants I think in that tote. Um, so yeah um, and <clears throat> yeah I'm excited for that because I with this approach to gardening I can definitely choose my favorites. Um, so like with the CSAs, there's still there's still a lot of food with CSAs and I love supporting the farm. So I might, I don't know, we'll see how this goes. Um, if I'm able to build it up to the point where I can get my favorite uh, vegetables out of it, I may not have to do the CSAs and that will actually save me a lot of snap money. Um, I don't currently... Uh, buy them I guess with my own money because of my current situation but um, I'm able to use the SNAP account but if I did eventually get a job and whatever I would have to use my own money so um, doing this now would actually save me potentially a lot of money in the future by um, just doing the doing my favorite so that's where I'm headed it's starting to drizzle so I'm really hoping that I don't get caught <laughs> to go look at it and see if it's clean enough to take for the trailer. Um, this is actually pretty exciting to me because this will mean I don't have to spend a couple hundred dollars on a mattress that may only get used um, for a couple of times. So until I actually... So I got the mattress. Um... And I guess perfect timing too, since I'm hoping to move the trailer this week um, to the new location. So I'll just uh, unload it at the new location. Yeah. So one last thing I have to buy for the trailer. <laughs> I'm at the trailer's new location and I'm going to be setting up my tent um, so I can use it for overnighting the last couple of days 
or not last couple of days, but for a couple of days or whenever I'm working on it, I need to stay here before I head over back home. Um, I picked out a trailer or tent spot. Um, it's pretty. It's in a small grove. It seems flat, but we'll find out, won't we?